Hi everybody, this is Phil again. Um, this time I am outlining a picture I started at work. Um, I was on my lunch and, and um, I wanted to do this yesterday, but got really busy and really didn't get um, time to even sit and even had to eat while I was working. So, um, but yeah, today I was able to sit down and do a sketch. Um, I took some s photos that I had taken out of the comic books um, this this is actually a character, Leslie, from the Unnatural comic series, more of a darker Zootopia story, and um, but she is she's the main character the book's focused around, and she's a um, blue-haired pig girl <laughs> about all you can um, has a few piercings on her, so she's, she's kind of punk, but um, the story itself I'm I'm not really gonna talk too much about it. Um, if you want to read it, it's very good. Um, I'm waiting for the next issue to come out in, um, uh, in October with um, issue four. Um, three really left me hanging. I really, I like when writers do that. So I'm really waiting for the next book so I can see where the story is going to continue on because it really left me with some shocks at the end. Um, as for this, um, this um, series is by uh, Mirka Andolfo. I believe Italian, and I've been following her artwork on Instagram, Twitter. I believe I believe I, she's on my Deviant Tart also. But um, yeah, I'm pleasant. I'm pleasantly surprised. Um, she does a lot of stuff for DC, and um, this series here, the Unnatural, is done through um, Image Comics. But yeah, if you want to check it out, her um. Art will definitely not disappoint. She does a very, very good job on her stuff. And she's always posting probably almost daily with something new in between her um, um, stuff that she's got to do for between this book and um, other obligations. <clears throat> Let's see. But, um, yeah, this is just something I really wanted to do a fan art piece of this because I, was, I'm, I really enjoy the um, story that she's put together here. And this one here, um, probably my next video, maybe um, I might color this. But yeah, she's a, a blue-haired pig with freckles. Really cute character in the book. Really likable. Most everybody in, that um, is around her is very likable. And I like when you can get into a story and really feel for the... Even hand-drawn characters... Get, you know, really feel for where their story's going, and a lot of comics don't do that anymore, which really is disappointing. Cause, I mean, even with X Men during the time with Jim Lee, he, you know, you had the basketball scene between Gambit and Wolverine and stuff, and you know, they they tried to um, humanize the characters when they're they weren't out and about doing superhero stuff. So I like I like a story that can, um, you know, really flesh out the characters to where. If something happens, you really you, you kind of get a concern over it, and that, that's what I like about this. So if you you know want to check it out, uh, check your comic shop. They should at least have a copy, and they do have variant covers. I believe almost every issue, which is nice. It gives you a choice of covers, whether you want um, the artist or somebody else. But um, that's about it. It's just a short video because I really like Marka's artwork here. And um, if you like this video, um, subscribe, hit the like button, and if you want to be notified, um, subscribe and hit that bell, and I will see you next video. Um, enjoy the rest of the outlining here with my pen.